songwriter, author, radio host. She does it all. Erica Campbell's third studio album, I Love You, is available now. The album features Stevie Wonder, He Smoke, PJ Morton, and many more. She joins us now in the studio to talk more about her a latest labor of love. Good morning. Thanks for being here. Absolutely. I'm First, to be here. Let me just say on behalf of the 992,000 members of the Calvary Fellowship Children's Choir, oh. thank you for Shackles. Because you gave us something else to sing besides this little light of mine. I love it. You are more than welcome. That is so funny. Tell me about this, this new album. Oh, my gosh. It's my I Love You album, and I'm excited about it because people are so weird when it comes to love. They, they connect love to, to a bad breakup or a broken family, but love is this beautiful, powerful thing that when you receive it, it can be healing. It can help you communicate better. You know, there's just so many elements of love, and I believe that God is love. And so I wanted to wrap it up in this album that's very honest, and transparent. It's not this perfect thing. It's, it's me and my brokenness surrendering that to God so and to me actually this. saying thank you to the people for supporting you. me for so long Absolutely. in my music and I'm just excited to kind of take it around the country, which is what I've been doing, to share this message of love. And you'll be performing it tonight as well, Yes, right? yes, tonight at APC in Morgan Park. I'm super excited yeah. about going there. This is, I think, my fourth one Okay. and there's still like three more weeks to go. So I'm, I'm hitting the pavement and touching the people, saying thank you, and literally talking about this message of love. Yeah, I love that because the world really needs to be wrapped up in love. we got so much going on right now. Yeah. Tell me how these features uh, came about. Stevie Wonder, oh, come on. Gosh. So my husband's good friends with him, and okay. he's working on his record, and he was talking about mine, and he was like, you should do something on the record. And he said, yes, and schedules happened, and I was like, it's not going to happen. And at the, right before we finished the record, he was on it, so super excited about that. Friends with D Smoke, mm -hmm. friends with PJ Morton, and I like to work with friends, yeah. you know, and uh, you've collaborated with PJ a few times too. I have, yeah, 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 super great. I've known his family. I love his parents and their church, and that whole thing. Super proud of all of his all of his success. And so when he said he'd be a part of this record, I was like, Let's go. This is kind of cool. Let's go through this list right quick. Okay. A mother, a yes. wife, an artist, a sister, a daughter, mm -hmm. Grammy winner, yeah, a national radio talk show host. Yes. What haven't you done? Ah. that you want to do? There's so much I, I want right? to do. Yeah, I mean, people will always need music. They'll always need encouragement. They'll always need that love. And God has done so much in my heart, and I've been able to overcome so much and learn so many life lessons that I really just want to share it in a song with as many people as I possibly can. I really, really do. And, and you know, people are like, when will you be tired or when will you be finished? I was like, when there's no songs in my heart, I'll stop singing. I feel no ways tired. No ways tired. I on. don't believe Come he's on. brought me this far to leave me. What advice would you give to anyone out there who may be interested in getting into the gospel music industry? Um, make sure your reason is real, mm -hmm. not based in fear or um, even rejection, but make sure there's really something in your heart and there's a reason bigger than you. And so if the reason is bigger than you, then even when you want to quit, mm. you'll keep going. Mm. You know, I can say no to Erica. Yeah. I can say, no, we're not doing this today. But when I'm working because I love my family or, you know, my faith is stronger, I keep going. And so you have to have a bigger reason than, than just you. Let, you know. let that move you forward. Beautifully said. And I got to tell you, folks, if you have used a sound on TikTok that goes nationwide, <laughs> he's on your, your side. side. You have her daughter to thank for that. That's my daughter. How does she feel about that going viral all oh, these years at, at later? At first, she was a little embarrassed, uh -huh. especially when kids at school would walk up and say it. But she's like, oh, it's cool. I said, well, will you post the video on your TikTok page? She was like, I don't know. And then she did it, so it's fun. And then Nationwide reached out, so. Really? Yes. Oh, that's awesome. Very nice. That's so awesome. Mm -hmm. I, I wasn't going to say this, <laughs> but it, uh, God has put it on my heart to, to thank you right now because um, Can't Give Up Now, your song with your sister Tina, yeah. got me through a very tough time. Mm -hmm. So I have this opportunity to tell you face to face, thank you. That song literally saved my life. Wow. You are more than so welcome. So you are a blessing to so many out there. Appreciate yeah. you coming in this morning. Oh an honor to gosh. meet you. Absolutely. Wow. Thank you. We'll be right back.